An avid and competitive golfer, John Williams worried that early onset Parkinson's disease would cause him to quit the sport he loved. Yet today, you can find him out on the links playing the game he loves because deep brain stimulation has eased his hand tremors. Before deep brain stimulation, John relied on medication to keep his Parkinson's symptoms under control. As a Parkinson's patient, when you take your medication, it kind of kicks in and you do well for a little bit. And then, but then as your medication begins to wear off, you know, you start to feel the symptoms. And so, you know, at work, I, I would know when it was time to take my medications. And it got to the point where every four hours, almost on, you know, on the dot, if I didn't take them, you know, I was really starting to experience, you know, some, some pretty bad symptoms. Because the medication was no longer working for John, he decided on deep brain stimulation, or DBS. He admits he was anxious about the surgery. Yeah, I was nervous the first time I considered deep brain surgery uh, for the obvious reasons, you know, it's brain surgery. <laughs> Yet John knew the team at the Ohio State Center of Neuromodulation had done this procedure many times, and that convinced him to opt for DBS surgery. In order for the surgeon to make sure the right areas of the brain are being stimulated, patients are awake during the procedure. Okay, say so I like to eat apples. Electrodes are implanted in the affected part of the brain that causes the tremors. These electric impulses are controlled by a pacemaker-like device that is placed in the patient's chest. I felt my tremors at, at their worst, and yet when they were experimenting and they were hitting just the right settings or whatever, you could hear almost a reaction from the doctors and the other, and the other people in the surgery room, like, wow, look at that, you know, how they would hit it and almost like shutting off a light switch, my symptoms should go away. When I came out of surgery, apparently I yelled OH and got a rousing IO from everyone in the OR. Recovery for John was quick. His tremors are gone and he's back at home and back at work. He only needs to meet with his neurologist every six months and he would recommend DBS for anyone with Parkinson's disease. Thanks to OSU, Center of Neuromodulation uh, and this procedure, I, I'm doing great. I'm living life. I'm an active uh, golfer. Uh, I love to golf. Uh, my wife and I, we love going to Ohio State football games. We love to travel. So yeah, I still work full time. Uh, you know, and no one at work is really aware of the fact that I have the disease. It works that well. Mm -hmm.